he played body Tetris, and uh, body everybody Tetris. everybody won. <laughs> Yeah, doing the show, I learned that we live very boring lives. Like sometimes I think my life is interesting and, and crazy and, and stuff. Like, <laughs> I wonder what? No, not really. Mm-hmm. Uh, that's why we do anybody listening who we each have like a scenario because we know if you can relate to this scenario, it's a very, very interesting story because it's not just like anybody who has a dog. It's like, no, like anybody who has a dog who's stopped a bank robbery, for instance. Like, mm-hmm. that's a big one. Yeah. Now, mine, um, I'm very excited about. Riley, yours was what? Anybody listening who has a Facebook kissy face of their ex. Or any social media. Any social Correct. media, yeah. Okay. Rose, yours was what? Anyone listening whose pet is ruining their love life. Okay. And mine was anyone listening who is in the Mile High Club because I was on a plane this weekend. It wouldn't happen for you, that's for sure. Got my rapid test. Oh, absolutely not. Because I went I went to use the <laughs> facilities. I was standing in there. Like, I had to bend my head. And I'm like... There's just no way yeah. this is real. Well, you're the Jolly Green Dragon compared to some, though. Well, but I'm just saying. So that that was mine. If you relate to any of these, if you have photos, uh, kissy face photos from the X and social media, if your pet is ruining your love life, or if you're in the Mile High Club, 877-995-4681. We can change your name. We can change your voice. Or you text 99338. Uh, Michelle, good morning. Good morning. Happy Monday. Happy Easter Monday, Michelle. Yeah. And you're calling in because you relate to whose story? Yours. Oh boy. Okay. Oh, and Michelle, really? so you you um allegedly joined the Mile High Club? Uh, I uh, allegedly did. Yes, this was a very long time okay. ago. Was it comfy? <laughs> uh, well, I, actually, yes. It, it, oh, this is awkward. No, uh, no judgment here, but like, so like, yeah. was it a long flight or a short flight? Because I feel like it'd be hard to do if you're flying like I don't know, a couple hours versus like a long haul. Mm-hmm. Um, it was uh, not a long flight. It was a uh, a late dark flight. Okay. Um, a nighttime flight that served um, unlimited drinks. Actually, um, they were promoting like okay. a um, local brewery, and sure. it was a very dark flight. Small plane, only two seats on each side, and um, yeah, laboratory wasn't used. Gosh. Wait, so, wait. So you guys, you did use the bathroom, or you didn't use the bathroom? No. Oh. oh my Michelle. Y'all got frisky out wow. in the open. Wow. Girl, so did we just were we were, we, sp- wow. were we spooning the whole time or what, spooning led to forking or what happened? It was a it was a spooning. Yeah, that's that's a that's a good play well, though. Okay. Because it just it just looks like oh they're just having a dream they're on a ship and that's why they're rocking back and forth. But no, yeah. okay. Oh right. Well, um, Michelle, um, they offered they offered us a blank. I mean, we got a blanket ahead of time, and I wore a skirt, so it was very helpful. Oh, oh get well. it, girl. Wait, did we? Okay, Ma- Michelle, I have a further question. Do we plan on this happening? Um, not really. Okay, <laughs> but. The drinks help? Yeah, no, a, 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 as I'm sure. sure it does. See, that makes sense. Like, that way it's like if it's a, a night flight, everybody's sleeping, they're probably not doing much, like, in service in the cabin. Like, that to me makes it seem like that's pretty realistic. Michelle, yeah. thank you so much for calling. Have a fantastic day. Oh, thanks. Bye. <laughs> Listen, no judgment here. Uh, let me go <laughs> to, okay, Rebecca wow. needs voice change. Hold on to this up. It's okay. We should be good with that. Uh, 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 this is fake name Rebecca. Good morning, fake name Rebecca. Hey. So uh, you're calling for whose story on anybody listening to? That would be yours. Okay. And uh, yours is is what? So I was, it was many, 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 many years ago. I was a teenager. It was a very long flight. I met this guy. He was very nice. Um, and nobody noticed that we slipped into the bathroom. Wait, so you guys met on the flight? Oh, my oh, God, what? Yeah. This is so notebook of you, fake name Rebecca. I know. Wow. Or is it, though? Uh, it was a fun time when it happened, and that was it. <laughs> so, I have some follow-up questions. Okay. Was, was it a long-haul flight or a short flight? It was a very, it was a very long flight. Okay, so we just happened to be sitting next to each other on the plane? sitting next to each other or if we just like met while we were I think I was walking up and down because it was such a long flight and we just started chatting and yeah so who who went to the bathroom <laughs> first like who how was the sign done um it was pretty instantaneous together like we were chatting and then yeah. we were in that little hallway and then it was like just 
Step on it. <laughs> oh, oh, okay. Wait, well, step on is a, a new phrase for me, but I just imagine it being like Django you know, once you get inside. I meant like we went from the hallway and stepped into the bathroom. Oh, okay. That makes more sense. Say so if you had a step on it, that's a, a that's a great problem though. to have. I mean, this was at least ten years ago, so I feel like they. May have been a little bigger, but it was really fine. You, you make it work. Yeah, so it was like basically you guys okay. played. You played body Tetris, and uh, body everybody Tetris. everybody <laughs> won. A little, but it's very real. Oh well, you know what? I need to. Thank you, Rebecca. Thank you so much for calling. Maybe have a great you should day. Give it a shot one time, John. Uh, that's a. I don't know <laughs> if I have the cojones. Thank you, Rebecca. Thank you for calling. Have a great day. Thank you guys. Have a great day. Bye, uh, Steve. Also, fake name and voice change. Good morning, sir. Hi, good morning. Okay, you're calling for who's on uh, anyone listening who? Uh, your story. Okay, and uh, so you you are in the Mile High Club? Yeah. Okay, how'd so, it happen, my friend? This has not been, like, same as a person before me. It was when I was a teenager. Um, but I did know the person who I did it with. Um, but the thing was that we were on a trip with our, both of our parents. <laughs> And um, my parents, well, both our parents were put in first class, and we were put in, you know, the regular. And so okay. me and him were talking, and, like, we didn't, like, we didn't plan this, but we both knew that we had certain interests that were similar. Sure, like cars and, and, and uh, baseball? Exactly. Yeah. <laughs> like, we both, mm-hmm. And so we both, like, were talking about certain things that we've never done. Yeah. And then we were, like, into halfway through the flight and there was still like I think like two or three hours left and it was dark already everybody was asleep and we were close by the bathroom and then we were just like hey do you want to try it yeah and I remember it was like mm, okay yeah and then, yeah we just went to the bathroom and play baseball exactly Listen, I, who would have thought? I want to call it that. Okay. Little, little, little baseball action in the bathroom. Fake name, uh, Steve. Huh. Thank you so much for calling, and thanks for flying YMS Air. <laughs> All right, have, a day. have a fantastic day. Okay, so uh, we got mine covered. Wow. We still got to get Riley's. Yes. Uh, if you have ki- kissy faces with an X on social media, and Rose, if your pet is ruining your love life, eight seven seven nine nine five four six eight one. All right, so Riley, yours for anyone listening who was anybody who has uh, kissy photos of an X on social media. Mm-hmm. Say good like morning still. to fake name Katie. Hello, fake name Katie. You are in voice change. Hi. So you um, relate to Riley's? Yes, I do. And oh. Why is that? So um, way far down, probably like when I was back in high school, I have some, or I have a few kissy photos with one of my exes, my very first ex-boyfriend, actually. Does your current have a problem with this? Um, no, not really. Does your current know about it, though? That's the yeah, real question. Has he seen it? Yeah. He knows. He Facebook stopped me, like, when we first started talking, so... Oh, okay, and is, yeah. it, is there okay. a reason why we've kept this particular ex? Um, he's just, like... One of my very good friends, and it's like we didn't have a very bad breakup. We just so didn't the, have a lot of chemistry. Yeah. So fake name Kate. Okay. Basically, you're saying that the door is still open. Yeah, I was gonna say the whole chemistry word. That's definitely different to describe an ex. Yeah. Oh. Yeah. Yeah. We didn't have the chemistry, but um, he's married now, and yeah, we're both happy. <laughs> That's, I mean, listen, okay. I no judgment here, but I'm just saying, like, it, it seems like doors still open potentially, Faith and Katie. If his wife gets end. abducted by aliens and <laughs> is never seen from again, like, there's a chance. <laughs> I guess, yeah. Okay, look at that. Wow, so okay. uh, I'm going to have to spend, hmm. we're going to send this to space and hopefully we can make this work out for you. <laughs> Faith and Katie, thank you for calling. Have a great day. Thanks, you too. My Bye. man. My man. My uh, man. Look at text in saying they don't delete photos. I guess that's, I don't really delete photos either, I don't think. I don't have it's any photos of, of exes up. I mean, there might be some tagged photos there. Okay. Like Facebook, and you could probably go through the archives and find one or two. Not on Instagram, Well, you though. can find a lot of Facebook, let's be honest. Kylie, yeah. good morning. Hi. So you're calling for Rose's uh, situation on anyone listening to. So you, your, your animal is ruining your love life? Um, yeah, so our puppy, who is eight months old, tries to lick all over us while we're trying to do stuff. Okay, but oh! what, what is what is the puppy's name? Uh, Maple. Oh, Maple. What kind of puppy is Maple? 
cute. Oh, she's a total mutt rescue. Oh, see, she's Ma- frisky too. Mabel, so awesome. Mabel sees mom and dad having fun. She just wants to get on the on the fun and play with you guys. And I, mm-hmm. you want to know what? You can't you blame her. Put Maple outside though. Like, no. Yeah, we try to lock her in her crate, and then she just whines. So either oh. way, it's oh. ruined. Yeah, that's like yeah. Uh, like when the dogs that's give rough. you the look, like you know when the dog gives you the poo look, and then like yeah. you give them the back look like, when they, they walk in you? on something. It's yep. like, listen, I don't judge you, you don't judge mm-hmm. me. Uh, Kylie, I hope <laughs> I hope you and boyfriend and, and Maple have a fantastic uh, rest of your year. Thank you so much. <laughs> have a great day. Um, I, I don't know if I told this before, but maybe I have. Like when I, with an ex girlfriend, the first time she slept over, Chewy peed on her head. On her head? Correct. Oh. Because I didn't have a real bed because I couldn't, I couldn't afford a bed. No. And so uh, I remember looking Chewy. at him like, bro, you put me in quite the pickle. Wow. Quite the hole. Like, my dog peed on my ex fiance's I mean, coat, but not his yeah, head. No, on the head was, uh, that was one of those things That's where it's a... just like, he, he put me in a hole. And, uh, you know, he's still yeah. around. Uh, ex Can't isn't so. From that. So maybe he knew. <laughs> but um, that's uh, anyone listening. You can continue yours over text 99338. 